Hey, this is Harold with HaroldNixon.com. Today I'm going to be showing you how to import audio files into Cubase. Uh, maybe one of your buddies has given you a project from another doll that you need to cut tracks on and uh, you need to learn how to import them in to cut some tracks on them. So I'll go ahead and get started. Uh, we're going to go to File and we're assuming this is going to be a new project. So I'm going to go ahead and click New Project. And uh, I want to go ahead and choose empty for my templates. Uh, you may already have one you've set up, but for this, it's going to be a clean slate. I'm going to hit empty, OK. And I want to set my project folder. For the demo I'm showing you guys today, I'm just going to go ahead and put it in my documents. And I want this to be, uh, we'll, we'll say this is a new album. So I'm going to click create. And I want this to be called album. And inside that album folder, I want this to be a song, an individual song within that album. So I'm going to hit the Create button again. I'm just going to create a folder inside album. And I want to call this, we'll just say Song. So now you can see we have Song, and it's nested inside of Album, and it's nested inside of My Documents. So we'll easily be able to find that again, and everything will be nice and tidy, and uh, we won't lose nothing. So let's go ahead and hit OK. That opens us up in the Project window. And uh, the next thing... Uh, we would want to point out uh, just a note to yourself uh, you want to make sure under project uh, project setup that you have the sample rate and the bit rate that you're uh, desiring to record uh, that's something you could easily overlook uh, so you you need to know what what your uh, sample rate you're wanting to record at in your bit rate uh, so we've, we've got all that like we want so I'm just going to hit and hit the file import audio file uh, now would come to the point where we're we would uh, choose our source. So more than likely this would probably be a CD or a, a DVD that uh, maybe one of your buddies has burned you and uh, mailed it to you or gave it to you. Uh, but it could be it, it could be off of a thumb drive or an external hard drive. Uh, for my demo here I'm going to be pulling files off the D drive. So I'm going to select my D drive and choose the location where the files are located. Uh, now comes the point where you could you could use a keyboard shortcut if we were going to get all these. You can hit Control A, we'll select them all. Uh, another option was if you only needed uh, just a few of these, you can hold down the Control key and then click and go down through here and pick out just the ones you need. But for this demo, I want them all, so I'm going to hit Control A. Okay. Now we're going to go ahead and hit Open. Brings us up this uh, import options. We do want to copy files to the working directory. If you're copying them off a DVD or CD, uh, uh, without copying them to the working directory, the drive's not going to keep up. You're not really going to get any playback. It, it does nothing. We need them copied to a hard drive that's going to be working where we can work on them. So we want to go ahead and hit OK. And that'll be importing all these in here. Just a reminder, go to haroldnixon.com. And uh, I've got some other tutorials coming up. And along with some project or uh, products there, so help support me. Okay, now uh, we get to the point where it's insert objects on one track or insert on different track. Uh, where we these are all individual things. We don't want them all piled up on one track. We want them individual tracks on top of each other. So we're going to choose different tracks, and that opens all these on different channels. So we see we got our 15 audio files we opened up there. And uh, just to show you we got them in there, we'll go ahead and play a little bit. And you can see we got it in there, no problem. So uh, for sure, we want to save, as always. I'm going to go ahead and click File and then Save. And we would save this. And now your project is ready to go. Uh, got all the files imported. Everything sounds good. And that's all there is to it. So thank you.